Pitt, 28, Virginia Tech, 7. Uh, my, my question here is, Justin Fuente, what the hell? What are you doing? Like this, Pitt, their defense has not been great all season. Uh, now, I guess we can expect like a, a good showing out of a Pat Narduzzi defense at some point, you know, it, it, whenever during the season. You can you can find it somewhere. But this is a team that gave up 44 points to Western Michigan, and Virginia Tech put up seven points in this game. And I know that it was a bit of a hangover because they were in that Notre Dame game and they thought they were going to be able to win that one. But this was, I mean, this was awful. Like, 224 yards of offense for Virginia Tech in this game. They only had the ball for 21 minutes. They could not sustain drives. They were not successful at all. And Pitt, on the other side, ran the ball. Like, 208 yards rushing in this game, 4.7 yards per rush, uh, for a team that cannot run. Like, doesn't, has not been able to run all season. It's been the Kenny Pickett show. This was shocking. To me, this was one of the more shocking results of the day because I I don't know what to make of it. Uh, Larry said, it's nice to see the ACC having competition. I, I don't know that Pitt's got any competition right now. Like, either Pitt is really good or Virginia Tech is awful. And I don't know which one it is. You got a, you got a thought on Fuente? Like, is this, is this the last rodeo? Yeah, probably. Probably. Yeah, I think so. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.